In the woods, our friends have been walking, exploring, and having a fun day. They are unaware that danger lurks nearby. This is wild hog country. Not cute, cuddly little oinkers like in The Three Little Pigs, but mean, savage, feral hogs with huge teeth called tusks that could easily kill a person. We join our friends as they are discussing Bible stories that happen in the woods, but it won't be long until things get exciting for them. My favorite is Esau because he was a hunter. If he was with us, he'd have his spear or a bow and arrow, whatever hunting weapon he used to hunt with. My favorite is David because he killed a bear and the lion with his bare hands. Wow, I wish I could have seen that. Y'all are impressive. With your knowledge of Bible stories in the woods, my favorite is Samson killing the lion on the road with the bees. Built a nest in the lion's dead body, Samson made a riddle out of it. Hey, are y'all hearing anything unusual? I don't hear anything. That's the problem. The birds stopped singing. The animals seem to be endangering from it. We better take cover just to be safe because we don't have any weapons. I wish I had Esau's spear right now. Here are some trees that are easy to climb. Let's get up in them and see what's going on. Great idea. And don't waste any time. The danger is what I think it is. We need to hurry.
saying thank you for putting these trees here so we could get away from those hogs. And look, they're leaving now. God gave us a great escape, just like he did for Daniel. 